us, all you wonderful YouTubers. Hello, a very good evening to you. It's me, Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster, the first lord of the internet, and we are live multi-streaming just for you, saying dinky do. So welcome, welcome, welcome. Tell everybody, of course, and come and join us. We have a choice. Now, what we're doing, maybe you could check this out for me, folks. We're live streaming on YouTube, of course, and we're also live streaming on uh, Facebook Live. So there we go. It's all happening. As we speak, fantastic stuff. Hello, everybody. There's Fiona and Angela have just joined us. Tremendous. Now, what are you getting here, folks? You're getting a bit of that's better. Are we still a sharp photo wise? Um, so there we are. J Dog, if you did a quick stream, it would probably not affect the connection badly as it's not long term. So there we are. Aha, focus has gone a bit. Does first pass the post? without a postal service, so the focus is gone. Is that better, J-Dog? Or is that better? Yes, I don't know that I want to touch the camera too much. Fantastic. Ever good evening, Scotty. Dinky do, my friend from Balloch. Long time no see. Stephen McMahon, dinky do. Now, guys, we're experimenting live on YouTube tonight. If you want to join us at Scotty McClure's YouTube channel, you'll see it up there. Do feel free. There's Ali Yule on. Good evening, Ali. Lovely to have you with us. <coughs> Jack Dinky Doo, how's that looking? And Stuart Martin McLaughlin. Jack Arthur, Fiona Hayward says hi. How fantastic is that? Lovely to be live streaming with you guys. And uh, we're multi-streaming. Tremendous stuff. So a little bit of focus. J-Dog, I shall try and see if I can... Sharpen that. Is that any better? Do tell. Now, can you all hear me and see me live? Big style. We're absolutely live. It's Sunday night. There we are. Nothing gets past me. Love the beard, Scotty. You suit it. Fantastic. And it's great to have everybody with us. Now, I'm going to see if I can do some adjustments to the lighting just to get everything on the right track. Very, very important. We'll see if we can get the lighting adjusted for you so that you have the very best of service from Scotty McClure and that you are wanting for nothing. You're breaking up on the platform, Scotty. You're fine on Facebook. Great quality. Evening, Scotty. The quality isn't as sharp. Must be taking the bandwidth audio. Still all good. Uh, not so sharp, says Glenn, on YouTube. There we are. But is the focus better? Are we better back now? Good evening, Scotty, says Susan Shaw. Good evening, Susan. Lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome. We are multi-streaming here. Fantastic. And if you've just joined us live on Facebook Live, a big dinky do to you. Wonderful to have you with us. How's the lighting looking? It looks a little bit dark on Facebook. Would that be fair to say? Does that sound fair to say? A little bit on the dark side. We don't want to be on the dark side. I can tell you that. Here you find Scotty. Hi, Scotty. Shout out to Stuart. We're in Aracha. Sal Williams. Dinky do. Deverdy in Aracha. Love the beard, says Louise Sullivan. Susan Forrest watching there. Fantastic. When are you joining? Oh, Steve Mack. When are you joining Fourth Valley Radio, Scotty? Ah, you got a wee mention in there. Well done, Steve. I don't mind. I like to mention all my colleagues. I like people to get a wee mention. There's, that's sort of looking a bit strange, isn't it? It's lighting up, and we're getting a wee bit at the side there. Hearing you loud and clear, says everybody. Fantastic. Uh, you're breaking up a lot, Scott. You've really pixelated on YouTube. Yes, oh, we don't want that. Anybody else seeing pixelations on YouTube? Tremendous stuff. Right, everybody on Facebook, uh, you can join me live on the YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash user, forward slash Scotty McClue 1. So it's really youtube.com forward slash user, forward slash Scotty McClue 1.
Come and join us, I say. Dinky dear, the lighting's fine. Uh, there's Kevin Dwyer. Fantastic. Hello, Kevin. Kevin, lovely to have you with us. Um, so there we are. Oh, people requesting to be in the broadcast. What's that like? Fantastic. We like that. We like it very much. There we go. And uh, what else have we got? Oh, hang on. Maybe you shouldn't start your broadcast until you're over 50. That's what uh, Dave does. No, no, not at all. Listen, as soon as you get one, you start your broadcast right away. I can't be bothered, Lawrence, uh, when you see people coming up live on a channel, on a platform, and then doing things like, eh, uh huh, there's Willie joining us now. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. We'll just wait a wee while. No, 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 launch your broadcast. And, uh, I mean, Lawrence, which one of us has been at the game longest? Come on now. So there we go. Absolutely. Louise Sullivan, Dinky Doo, Lighting's Fine. Wonderful Gordon Roddick's watching. Alan McDonald, Dave Anderson, Jim Fanko, Barbara Ann Haig. Some fabulous big names there, guys. Lovely to have you all with us. Good evening, Scotty. Excellent stuff. Uh, says, um, what have we got? Yes, remember listening to you. Uh, good evening, Scotty. I'm not picking a Republic argument with you today. Have a nice evening. Absolutely, Alan McDonald. You can pick an argument with me any time, and I will inform you, because I haven't done 50 years of research in uh, international affairs, economics, politics, religion, leadership, all that stuff for nothing. So you might as well get the benefit. The Wi-Fi is trying to choose what device. That's why it's better on Facebook compared to YouTube. It's my birthday today, so Susan Shaw. Fantastic nationwide coin hunt. Hello and dinky do. Hi, Scotty. Hope you're well. So the wonderful Jim Fankel. And we're watching on uh, both devices here. Fantastic. So there we go. Yes, Scott, you remember listening to you back in the 90s <laughs> in the prison, says Gary. Oh, my goodness me. Yes, with a lot of people in the big hoose, Gary, used to listen to McClue. And really, the number of letters that I have had from uh, people, ex-cons and all the rest of it, just saying thank you for all the late night shows and uh, how it kept them going. It's tremendous. So I think if I was ever in trouble, uh, you know, I, I might be, uh, I might have somebody that's got my back, you know. <laughs> Fantastic. So there we go. Scotty, you're an expert in what you do. Keep up the good work, boss. Scotty, bad quality on YouTube. Brilliant broadcasting from you as always. Charles McLaughlin, I'm not having bad quality. I think we'll have to say farewell to our friends on Facebook for now, just because it's reducing the quality, guys. But there's a phone in in the offing. So get that message loud and clear. Share this little broadcast as much as you possibly can. There's work going on all the time. So there we are. All that research before my time. I'm only a youngster. Well, Alan, I can help you to uh, pick up huge knowledge. This is what makes me laugh about these discussions and arguments when we're on Facebook. You have people that lose it right away. You got, you make a point and they go, absolutely. Yeah. 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 And they don't know what they're talking about. And that worries me a little bit. So there we go. Um, Nationwide Coin Hunt says you look like someone that would work in a call center. Hello, good afternoon. Can I help you? Hello, this is McClues. Yes, who do you wish to speak to? It's ringing for you. One moment, please. Hello, McClues Pies. Can I help you? Good morning. <laughs> so there we go. Uh, thanks, Glenn. Very much appreciated. Glenn, are you going to give us a call tonight for the chit chat? Neil Mills, Brian McCarran. Hello, Scotty boy. Hope you're well, mate. Dinky do, Brian. Lovely to hear from you. And please give my regards to everybody in my uh, my other lovely family. Hello, Scotty boy. The crack is good, says the wonderful Steve Clinkscale. What a top man. Wonderful name that. Steve, loved your message about the old accordion. And when I'm flush 
maybe the nation will buy me one before I pass on, and uh, we'll get uh, we'll get the accordion exchange because that one. I showed you, I've had it 20 years, and somebody said, oh, it's well over 50 years. It's a Swedish accordion, and it's got a duff note, um, and the problem is, it'll just you would have sorted it in seconds, a little wire or something twisted the wrong way, but it sticks, and of course it ruins every tune. Love your beard, says Neil Mills. Do you like that one, Neil? There we are, a wee change. How's the quality doing over on YouTube here, guys? And uh, I'll put... Please feed back on quality. Please feed back on quality. We've got so many devices running now, guys. Apparently, we have um, a quality control issue. Um, so there we go. Scotty, a question for you. Do you like people being stubborn and having to be brought over to your way of thinking? Uh, no, Glenn. I don't have anything to prove on that, um, but I like seeing people being properly educated. So most of these idiots arguing about not needing a monarchy, they don't understand how the state works. And their first thing is they try and give the impression that it costs us a lot of money to maintain the monarchy. Now, the monarchy isn't cheap to maintain, but what I can tell you is that um, it's virtually self-financing. So Her Majesty the Queen's office is financed by the Duchy of Lancaster. And uh, I think Michael Gov, the MP, is the um, Chancellor of the Duchy of Lancaster. It's usually a distinguished politician. And um, then we have the Prince of Wales office, which is financed from the Duchy of Cornwall. So there you are. And the royal family are outstanding public servants, absolutely outstanding, and uh, bring in some serious, serious money. I mean, this country brings in about 200 billion pounds in tourism. You've got to remember that. The royal family themselves can bring in a couple of billion pounds just through all their wonderful work. And the people that go, oh, they're so rich when people are starving. If you did not have a royal family, people would still be starving. Starvation is political, all right? Austerity, political. Do we get that? Christopher Anti Smith, dinky do. Carmack McCusker, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. So, no, Glenn, I don't need to bring people over to my way of thinking. I just need to ensure that people have got the facts. That's all I'm interested in. Fantastic stuff. Uh, so, there you are. They're famous for being famous, says Welly Song. Yes. They're famous for being famous, absolutely. Where's the cup of tea tonight, Scotty? Alistair King, how lovely to have you with us. The cup of tea had to be put to the side because we had a wee technical emergency. And as you know, I'm no technocrat, uh, although we've got some great stuff running here, I have to say. Can you all start sharing, guys, and let everybody know? Uh, top form, Scotty, I know you couldn't resist. Absolutely. Mum said I could watch your show, says Frank Meyer. Okay, Frank, welcome, I say. As long as Mum said. There we go. Now, here's the tea. It's Earl Grey Alistair. It's gorgeous. It's so lush. A lovely cup of tea. I tend to stick to the Earl Grey in the mornings. And uh, just a plain biscuit. Now, my grandfather in Argyle, wonderful man, born in 1881. He was born the same day that they laid the foundations. No, I think that they opened the um, Victoria Tower and the municipal buildings in Greenock. You know, these very, very impressive buildings that Greenock's got there. Um, Charles Smith, I personally don't have a problem with the monarchy. It's Westminster and this 313-year-old draconian union that needs dissolving. Well, Charles W. Smith, I think you've got a very, very uh, fair point there. But the, the, what I'm trying to get the, the halfwits, 
You mustn't call them half wits. They're not half wits. The anti monarchists to understand is that there can't be independence until the future of the monarchy in Scotland has got 100% clarity. All right. Very, very important that. So there you go. Now, it's not, you know, the two are not mutually exclusive. I don't like to call the monarchy a sideshow because it's so important. But compared to the political side of things and the economic side of things, but you've got to remember we have a parliament in Scotland by the largesse of the monarch. And people go, oh, but the Scottish people are sovereign. They're sovereign. They have been granted parliamentary sovereignty by the monarch. But the monarch is the ultimate sovereign. Yes, do we have that? So there we go. Fantastic, Alan. You can come back to me, Alan. Welcome from Australia, says the wonderful Frank Meyer. So Erica has said you could watch. Tell her she is fantastic. Give her a big hug. Watching all the way down in Southampton, William Scotty Love. We love Southampton. I, oh, I could stay in Southampton as well. These are all beautiful places. That's another thing that I would have no truck with. If Scotland goes for independence, we embrace our English brothers and sisters, our Welsh brothers and sisters, our Irish brothers and sisters, and those who don't identify as male or female. We embrace all humanity. Tremendous. Uh, I'm having a caramel latte. Caramel latte. Alistair King, you've kind of got me there. What is a caramel latte? Uh, can we all feed back here, please? Uh, so there we go. Scotty, did you see the previous Labour leader's brother take a protest at Sheffield about COVID-19? I did a chat on a TV news channel with a certain someone saying COVID didn't exist. Yes, I think that's a bit too far, that one, to be absolutely honest with you. So, Alistair King, you'll have to tell us, what's a caramel latte? I know latte usually gets associated with coffee. So, I would imagine latte is ole, so it's milk. Is it all in Italian? Will do. Mum, I says, I'll always learn something. Oh, you'll always learn something. Absolutely. But your mum is a person of great wisdom, as you know, as we all know. Uh, and you listener, says Steve, my sister, Scotty, Belinda, there we are, my sister, Belinda. Uh, it reminds me of a wee song, that, but I'll probably not sing it just now. Uh, fantastic. Kevin Dwyer, coffee in the morning, green tea throughout the day. Ah, the green tea. Tea gives the kidneys a bit of a workout, though, and sometimes you have to dash off. You have to go a place, pay a visit. Mm. The noon pottery. We love it. Absolutely. Uh, similar to a capacitor, says Alistair King. A caramel latte is similar to a capacitor. Alistair King, am I right in saying when you say capacitor, you used to replace the parts in a distributor with a set of points and sometimes a condenser, a tiny little cylindrical thing with one wire coming from it. Is that right? It's just, you've just brought me here. You've gone into the darker recesses, the deeper, I should say, not darker, the deeper recesses of my mind and come up with that. When David Hennessy's watching, fantastic. Uh, I will do, says Frank. Frank, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. That's fantastic. There we are. Top form. Uh, who else have we got? Welcome from Australia. I don't have my hat. I normally, if I've got an Oz on, Frank, I change hats and I put on my jackaroo. Yep, and I talk Australian to everybody. Fantastic. Spelling, Scotty. So, Alistair King, please do not worry about the spelling on here. You won't be marked on it. We are not having, we're not judging people on their spelling. I can tell you. That's fantastic. Now, how is the quality on YouTube, please, everybody? 
How's the quality on Facebook? Watching all the way down in Southampton. Love it. My sister Scotty Belinda. Absolutely, Steve, got you there. And, uh, you know, I think maybe we've seen her at the window. So there we go. Gary Murphy. Coffee in the morning, green tea. Yeah, we've done that one. So there we are. Fantastic. So if you've just joined us, a very warm welcome. If you're wondering what on earth's going on, you're watching Scotty McClure, the world's top broadcaster and the first lord of the internet. And we are live, big style, on YouTube and Facebook Live, just for you, Dinky Doo. Very good. Very good, Steve. Yes. I think... Uh, I think when your sister was at the window, uh, did you have your sombrero on? I asked you, Steve. Would that be right? Have I got that right? I heard you could play the squeeze box as well. You're all clear here. Well, no, not. We've got a very distinguished squeeze box man watching. But since he is, I'll let him see my little addition here. What do we think, Steve? Are you up for that? Do we know this chappy well? Now, I can't play it, as you're about to hear, but um, I do like it. Uh, that's the thing. I can't play it, but I do like it. So uh, we'll see what we can do. I don't want to catch my headphones on it. We don't want a disaster. So there we go. Let's see if we get sound for it. <laughs> Steve, opinion on that one, Charles W. Smith. I love the box. There we are. Well, it's a fine wee box. There she is, there, Steve. So you can see her. Uh, you know, very nice. I think uh, dear Jimmy actually had one of these. Jimmy Shand had one of these as well. The only trouble is, thanks, Frank. The only trouble is when you go back to the the um, piano key. You start pushing it in and out, trying to get a different note, and your brain wonders why you can't. Eat. So, fantastic. So there we are. That's what's going on there. Uh, yes, regarding the capacitor, you're correct. It's part of the distributor for the points. Now, that, that is the capacitor the condenser, right? Oh, no, it's a condenser, though, not a capacitator. That's what I thought, Alistair, yes. Beth Carmichael, hi, Scotty. Uh, so there we are. Giorgio is uh, saying, he's giving me a round of applause. I thank you, Giorgio, from Crete. How beautiful is that, the Crete people? Please don't think I am being disrespectful when I try to talk in a Cretan accent. I, I, is it any good? Any good, Giorgio, I ask you. So there are sick and blow, a wee bit of sick and blow. All the men um, talking about a big diesel engine to a mechanic one night in the pub in Yorkshire. And I said, I wondered if you'd have a look at it. Uh, and he said, aye. I said, do you know the engine? He went, well, he said, they all uh, suck, blow, bang and fart. So there we are. <laughs> suck, blow, bang and fart. <laughs> John McClucky. Fantastic stuff. Compression ignition. 
There we are. Wonderful, wonderful. Giorgio, you're making me homesick for Crete. The problem with McClure is he is a child of the universe. And, um, you know, I, I can be at home anywhere. And Crete puts its arms round you. The only thing I remember, a chap coming back, he'd been shopping in Heraklion. And he came back, he lived in this country, and he was um, from your place. And he um, came back one morning, we were all lying at the pool relaxing. And he comes in and he goes, I was in Heraklion. They are crazy. A man was trying to lie across my body, walking across the road. He's, whoa, ha, ah, I'm going to need to have something to, to calm me down. <laughs> Do you know what I mean by that, Giorgio? Mum would like to know how's the fox. Ah, tell her. The fox is absolutely wonderful. So there we go. Um, have you seen the videos on YouTube? If you put on a visitor to McClure Towers, and you'll see the fox. We might even be able to uh, get you a picture of him before the end of the show. Fantastic. So there we go. Now, how's everybody getting on here? Eee, <laughs> bye, gum lad. Glenn, Glenn, I'm, I'm wanting you to do me a favor. Can you get on the Skype, la? See if we can get you on the Skype. Do, please. Uh, I think that would be great. Give it a shot, Glenn and see uh, what happens. So there you are. Glenn is going to give us a Skype call, guys, because the way ahead's a phone in, and there's one in the offing. Scotty, you're like a fine whiskey. <laughs> you mean, I get better as I get older, as I mature, in an old sherry cask. Fantastic. It's beautiful. Um, but so, where are you... Where you are from, we are both lucky. Ah, oh, yes, no doubt about that, Giorgio. I think we are very lucky. And I told you last night about the lovely guy that used to listen to the Scotty McClue phone-ins. That wasn't yourself, was it? And he studied in Glasgow. Scotty, did you get my wee text about the badge? I did, Thomas. Thank you. Yes, unfortunately, I don't have any more at the moment. I've got this one and the emergency one at the back. And I think there's one more. But what we'll do, uh, you know, if the phone in, no, not if the phone in takes off, when the phone in takes off, we'll see if we can get you a Scotty McClure badge. Can everybody see that? Fetch an absolute fortune, these badges, believe it or not. There we are. Can you see that? Scotty McClure, didn't you do? I'm holding it the wrong way, putting my hand over the print. So it says Scotty McClure. Oh, they've got it sideways. Scotty McClure, thank you do. That's the badge. So once I get some of these, yes, of course, you can have one. No problem at all. So there we are. So, Glenn, if you can get your Skype fired up or somebody, give us a call, Scotty Dot McClure. Jamie Cammy, how are you, Scotty? Fantastic, Jamie Cammy. Lovely to have you with us. So there we are. Uh, Alistair King says we're going to have a hot toddy, but I'd better not work at 6 a.m. Not even worth it, Alistair. In fact, far be it from me to say, but when you don't have booze at all, I told you I gave it up five years ago. I didn't have to. I just gave it up. And uh, it's fantastic. John McClucky, God, I've missed these broadcasts. So they are dinky to you, John. Lovely to have you with us. Stuart McLean. John, do you remember we used to get thousands Time for me to go, Scotty. Can't wait till the next show. Take care, everyone. Frank Meyer, take care. And uh, a big hug to your mum, I say, to our Erica. Dinky do. Love from the Foxes. Stuart McLean has just joined us. Welcome, Stuart. Lovely to have you with us. I have electronic ignition on all stuff. Well, that engine we were talking about is electronic ignition. But I think it would be a late addition. It's a wee box of tricks. I think they're quite dear. A wee white box of tricks. And the name begins with an L. Is that right? Is that familiar? Beth Carmichael says, hey, Scotty. Hiya, Beth. Dinky-do. <laughs> Lovely to have you with us. Fantastic. Okay, dinky-do, says Frank. Dinky-do, Frank. Take care of yourself. Fantastic. Glad you've enjoyed joining us. See, when I put my hand up, I get a tan. <laughs> Look at that. I become tanned. It's fantastic. <laughs> Electronic ignition. 
Uh, it says Scott is unavailable. What a lot of nonsense, Glenn. Where are you getting this from? I'm here. Absolutely. Absolutely available. Come on now. Don't be giving me all that nonsense. Yep, everything's active. Everything's live. Tremendous. No problem at all. All sorted. Well, that's that. So we'll see what's happening. Uh, Provost William Henry has joined us. Dinky do, Provost. Lovely to have you, my lord. Uh, dinky do, dinky do. Absolutely fantastic. So there's Frank in Australia. Uh, just saying dinky do, dinky do. Scott, he says, Stevie. Stevie, how are you? Uh, is it Stevie or Stevie? Jammy Cammy. Tremendous stuff. Have you ever considered writing a novel, Scotty? Well, Jammy Cammy, if you go onto YouTube and you put in Scotty McClure Deliver Us From Evil, you'll get chapter one of my thriller. There we go. Fantastic. I get asked for my um, autobiography. Very flattering, but I'm not sure would people be interested. That's the big question. That is the question, to be or not to be. So there we go. This has just been incredible, guys. How are we doing for time? Oh, my goodness. We're nearly out of time. I do apologize if the quality went down a little bit on YouTube. Um, what I might do, Brian Hall's watching. Dinky do, my good man. Dinky do, Brian. I might say good night to all our beautiful people on Facebook Live. Thank you for joining us, Dinky Doo. We're part of a big experiment. There's a phone in coming back, so get ready for that. Please go on to Scotty McClure's YouTube channel and click subscribe. Now, actually, please do it. It's very important. And tap the bell so that you get notifications for what's happening. All right? So, there you are. so we'll say good night and bless you on uh, Facebook Live, and from everybody here at Scotty McClure, from everybody on YouTube, from everybody on all the platforms, have a wonderful week. Thank you for joining us tonight, and dinky-doo. Good night, Steve. Steve Klinkscale, good night. Thank you for listening. We will be in touch. Dinky-doo.